think so. <coughs> and if it doesn't, then she can fix it. And I can also show them right on the computer now with the new SDS system. There's an ice cream that shows when someone took a sick day or vacation. In addition on that notice that I'll state that individuals to use whatever type time off they have, they must go perform, which will be available in the various secretary's offices. Tells Linda what to do on payroll. 
Sandy, Sandy sets up the whole payroll, reduces, takes the personal days off, sick days off, vacation days off. Then a form is sent down to Linda, and Linda runs the paychecks based on the information that Sandy's given. Okay. So because we have so many payroll questions <coughs> that are still coming, shouldn't, would it be more, I'm just trying to find out, maybe we should do an audit for all of these, because we we'll make all the grievances happy, then everybody knows exactly what, where we're at. What people are seeing is their pay stub, and we don't see their pay stub. Yeah, An audit is to compare A with B, and if their pay stub, the amount of money that goes on there, if the one that you leave. showed me when I had that question, mm -hmm. shows the leave or everything else they take, and that's on the slip that she sends over Linda. Now, so talking, it's identical information. But we're talking about what the what the employee sees is their pay stub. So in order to do an audit, we would need to see the pay stub. But their pay stub is in these letters that yeah. Sandy sends to Linda. That's the paycheck they get. So All that information, because that's the only thing that Linda runs the payroll on. Okay, it's what Sandy's, tell me if I'm wrong, Sandy. You tell Linda how many days and hours to pay each employee. Right. Okay. Let me get, but, let but, me get but, when somebody comes in and says, I took 16 hours of vacation, uh -huh. Sandy...